Hey guys, welcome back to my YouTube channel. My name is Edgar, and if you're new, welcome to Thrift Kingdom. I am a full-time dumpster diver, part-time thrifter, full-time reseller, and today we're gonna go dumpster diving. It's too hot outside for her. Are you coming with me? <laughs> All right, let's see if there's anything inside this treasure chest. Of course there is. There's always stuff in this dumpster. Well, there's no reason for these waters to go to the landfill. We can use the water and recycle the plastic, of course. There you go, brand new sealed water bottles. <laughs> what? Let's take them. All right, brand new water. We can always recycle the plastic and of course drink the water. There's this big fan, I wonder if it works. Reese's Pieces. And a whole bunch of snacks again. <laughs> All right, let's take these. I should probably take that fan, and I probably will, but for now, I'm just gonna put it on the side. I'm gonna take these boxes that are sealed. You can always donate those. Bags of candies that are sealed, 70 pieces. Let's take these for sure. Another box. Oh, I love this gum, but it's not sealed. Oh, check that out. There's a whole bunch. Let me bring my grabber. Okay, so I have my easy pick grabber. I'm gonna pick up this candy for sure. More Reese's Pieces. Let's take these donuts. Oh, I love these. These are so good. What? I'm gonna take them. I'm gonna okay so I'm just gonna grab a whole bunch as many as I can and I'm gonna start throwing them in my car what Twinkies <laughs> expensive brand wow Okay, so this happens very often. This store throws away like a whole bunch of food that's sealed and stuff. Um, so it's nothing new. Well, it's nothing new to me. All right, so there's a whole bunch more. Okay, so if all of this was right in front of you, would you pick it up as well? Let me know in the comments. I always read all the comments. These are actually really good too. Okay, so I'm gonna leave some behind. Uh, I think the trash passes tomorrow. The, the trash that picks up this dumpster, I think they pass tomorrow. But I'm gonna leave some behind just in case there is uh, somebody passing by and another diver uh, wants these items i'm pretty sure they will i'm gonna take this fan see if it works at home there's an airplane passing sorry okay so i feel bad leaving some behind but i opened the bag so if somebody comes and takes a peek they will see all of this and hopefully somebody takes it i really hope somebody takes it the trash passes tomorrow let me know in the comments what would you do there's this dumpster full as you can see of snacks and chips that are sealed <sighs> that's crazy <laughs> i might jump in there or use my easy pick grabber Nice. 
Okay, so something cool about this grabber is that it has magnets on the tip. So if you're trying to pick up jewelry or something, it helps you pick up anything that's metal and it also floats. It's called Easy Pick. And again, uh, if you want one like this, um, check out the description box in this video. I have a link that if you buy one using my link from Thrift Kingdom, I get a small percentage. I think I'm gonna leave some behind just in case somebody else comes. The only thing, like I mentioned, is that the trash passes tomorrow, it picks up the dumpster trash. So there's a possibility that it might not get saved. But then again, I don't know, maybe it will. However, I think I'm gonna jump in there to grab one of those boxes and the other one bring it closer for somebody else that wants to take it. Okay, so here's one box. In this box right here, should I take it? Oh, I can give it to people. I can pass it out. I changed my mind. I'm gonna take it. Because I know I can find people to give it to. I'm gonna take these right here. And I'm gonna leave those. <laughs> Check that out. My car got full real quick. Uh, there's a fan and there's a whole bunch of snacks and food. Again, the trash passes tomorrow. Uh, there's a chance it might not get saved by somebody else in time. So this is why I'm taking a lot. And I know I can pass them out to people. So that's good. Okay, so I was checking the dates on these. Uh, today is July 2022. These don't expire till October 18 of 2022. A lot of times uh, stores throw away some of their products because they're not selling or they just receive a brand new uh, shipment with the newer dates so they have to toss the oldest to make space so to me it's crazy how uh, there's stuff that's not even expired in the dumpster you know it's it's crazy and i'm just glad that i was able to rescue it and hopefully somebody else takes the rest check out all this stuff that we saved so much food that's going to be donated it was destined to go to the landfill but we saved it we did good oh and these boxes of course are full of chips let's go say hi to marvel marvel <laughs> and pablo came to say hi to us uh he comes and goes he doesn't he's not coming as often as before but check his eyes out they're blue he's also a very friendly cat and he just started showing up out of nowhere and he's been here with me for already like six months six seven months but he comes and goes marvel's a little bit more loyal lately and she's been staying here <laughs> Okay, so uh, my kitchen's kind of small, but uh, here you can see all the bags that I put together. I try to stuff them as much as I could. There's a total of 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12, 13, 14. I go to this area where there's people that don't have homes. They live under a bridge, and they always really appreciate when I take them uh, sealed stuff. So uh, we're going to go ahead and do that. Let me know in the comments if you guys want to tag along, if I should uh, record a little bit so you guys can get the hang of it and maybe it's something that you can do too. I really love giving to people, straight to people, because i actually seen how, you know, how it makes a little difference uh, for them in their day. So I put all of these together, save them from the landfill, and I'm sure we're going to find people that are going to be um, happy to receive these uh, donations. I'm going to jump in here with a voiceover and bring you along to donate some of the food. Thank you very much. Sure. I really appreciate it. Thank you. Okay, so I really enjoy going to this part of my town. It's a bridge where there's a lot of people that don't have homes and I like taking the food that I find. I'm just one guy, so I really don't eat much. I donate like 98% of the food that I find. 
And I like going to this area because I like seeing that the food is going straight to people. That's actually being uh, taken by someone. Here she's telling me that these items are going to help her out. And a lot of the people here are going through a bad chapter in their life. So if we can remember that and remember them and do something small for them. I think that is something good. Here she's telling me that a lot of the people are not under the bridge right now because they're walking around. Now, I don't know if this is true or not, but I heard that some food banks throw away some of the food that gets donated because it's not healthy enough or it doesn't meet their requirements. So, I again, I don't know if that's true or not, but I like seeing that somebody's actually picking up these items because it would defeat the purpose of what I do if I take the food and then the donation center throws them away so by the time you watch this video i have found so much more food so let me know in the comments if you want to come along with me the next time in my previous video i found these vases i listed them locally and right now i'm about to meet somebody that's interested in buying them and i'm gonna bring you along let me know in the comments if you like whenever i bring you along for my diving sales um i put them in separate bags so they wouldn't uh okay break or anything here they are if you want to check them out it's okay, I'm just doing a project with them anyways. Okay, cool. Thank Here you go. Alright, thank you so much. Alright, so I'm finally home. I had to take a quick shower because it's so hot outside right now in Texas. It's about 105 degrees, but it feels like 200 degrees. Now, um, I'm really excited about this video. Today's finds were amazing, and I'm very satisfied with what we found today, what we rescued from the landfill. If you enjoyed this video as much as I love making it, please leave me a thumbs up. That really helps my video, and it helps me make more YouTube videos for you. Also, consider subscribing since that helps out my videos to be pushed towards other people. As always, my favorite part of my videos are the comments. I love reading the comments, especially knowing where you guys are watching from and these type of comments as well, where you guys are telling me that y'all weren't so aware of what's going on at the landfill, the importance with recycling. So I'm really proud of you guys for recycling, for dumpster diving, for thrifting, reselling, donating. I really do feel that together we can make a difference. I'm proud of you. Let me know in the comments what was your favorite dumpster rescue from this video. For me, it had to be the food, and I'm just so glad that we found uh, people that wanted or needed these items. As always, remember to sell your stuff or donate your stuff. The landfill already has way too much. It doesn't need any more, trust me. And also, of course, remember to recycle. All the cool kids recycle, so recycle because you are cool. See you on the next night.